Uh, recognitions, let's start with, uh, uh, so during sunrisers, it's uh, summertime, a lot of us like to travel, so I'd like to recognize a few of the people and, and where they've been. Uh, Tomas, you recently were in Portland. Hey, I was in Seaside. Okay, so uh, west of Portland, where I had never gone, been before. My wife's family's in Portland, and we had a little mini family reunion out there. Some folks from Coeur d'Alene came down. And, Seaside's an awesome. I was like, why are we leaving the cold coast to go to the cold coast? But then when we got there, I realized it's a lot different. It's, it was warm, actually. I got into the ocean. Um, really beautiful place. Had a great time. The kids had a ball. Tons of stuff to do. So, yeah. Great. Great. Uh, Carol, you have a fun trip. Yeah, I just got back from a three and a half week road trip with my husband um, from here, between here and Minnesota. Car camping along the way. Wow. National parks. Bears in Teton and Yellowstone. Interesting bear encounters. I now own a canister of bear spray. Um, <laughs> one of our campgrounds, we had a grunting herd of bison go like the feet of our tent and uh, lots of friends and family along the way. So it was a really good trip and trying to get back in the groove. So, anyway, it was fun. All right, all right. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Howard. We went to uh, Eugene, Oregon. Uh, which we do every year for the Bach Festival and just great music for two and a half weeks. And our daughter lives in Eugene and our son lives in Grants Pass. So really nice. Did you, did you play at the Bach Festival? <laughs> <laughs> don't don't I wish. wish. No. <laughs> uh, they had professionals come in from all over the world. It was tremendous. Yeah. Wow. It's exciting. Thank you, Howard. Sarah. Um, my first camping sisters and all of their kids and cousins and my cousins live in San Francisco and my cousins from Colorado and my uncle in Hawaii and Texas and all of them. We all joined together. So it was really fun. Yeah, sounds great. And uh, uh, oh, go ahead. Deb. So I was fortunate enough to spend three weeks in Alaska Ooh. and I'd never been before and I wasn't, so I like to travel internationally so I wasn't, didn't know how excited I was about Alaska. And then I got up there, and it's just beautiful, and it's huge. And I don't know if you folks have been, but it's just amazing. So I was as far south as Seward, and as far north as Denali National Park. Um, spent several days in Denali. It was incredible. Um, thought I'd see a whole lot of moose. Ended up seeing a lot more grizzly bears than moose, which was a surprise. Um, but it was just, it was wonderful, and it was a great trip. That sounds amazing. And uh, Ed, I saw you, did you sneak in a Giants game there well back? <laughs> yes. So my wife's best friend of 30 years called us a week and a half ago, two weeks ago, and said, hey, we're going to be in San Francisco, and that's near you, right? <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, we're, we're an inch away in that. So we went down and spent uh, a long weekend with them. They wanted to go to a Giants game where they got killed. Um, but it was nice. We did the touristy thing. We rode the bus with the open top, and we walked the Golden Gate Bridge. Fun. Oh wow! Oh, wow! That sounds great. Great. All right. Anybody else have a chance to get out of here? No. All right. I do want to recognize um, um, Jose, who uh, recently got a new job. Jose, do you want to tell us about your uh, well, yeah. Uh, after you know, plus ten years, I'll be leaving uh, HSU Dining Services, uh, and I'll be starting at Wells Fargo oh. in New York. What are you going to be doing at Wells? I'm going to be starting off as a teller and then, uh, you know, taking my first steps uh, into the industry and then moving up and, uh, yeah, wow. getting up there, hopefully. That's exciting. Time. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you.